Gearhead 327, uh, today's video is going to be why block hugger headers suck, okay? And they suck big time. Uh, now, on the uh, passenger side, I got no problem with that. They get uh, plenty of clearance, got room around the motor mount, you know, they fit on there nicely. Now, when you get to this side over here, they want to hit this motor mount. So, Let's look at the two sets I've got here. Now this was um, a cheap pair I got off of eBay and they really suck, okay? And they, uh, I've had to do some extensive modifications and they still don't fit. So that's grinding and that's beating and these things are garbage, all right? Now these are some block hugger headers I got from Summit and they suck too, just not as much. I had to, um, as you see, modify that and to get these to fit, I had to grind a little bit of this motor mount. Now, I didn't grind through it. I just ground it down a little bit so it would have a little clearance there. And I didn't weaken the structure because this is still intact and these motor mounts are still plenty thick. And this is probably only a 350, 375 horsepower engine and I think that's going to be sufficient. Now if I was going high horsepower I wouldn't be grinding the uh, motor mounts down and I wouldn't be using block hugger headers but for the application this is going in I don't have a lot of room so but anyway guys I just wanted to uh, share that with you if you have a chance to buy the correct headers I would recommend that otherwise you're going to have to um, do some judicious grinding and make a lot of special modifications yourself. So let's uh, let's see if I can do this one-handed here. We'll put this on. I need to put the gasket on there. All right. We'll try and do this one handed. There we go. Okay. You can see my problem is that bolt right there, which I've clearanced that, and it hits. Well, when I tighten it up, it won't hit, but there's not a lot of clearance there, and then it hits right here so the other option is to have some custom headers made and I might I might just do that because this is a royal pain okay guys I just wanted to share that with you in case any of you were thinking about putting some block hugger headers on your um, small block Chevy and you have these clamshell style of uh, motor mounts all right the video wouldn't be complete if I didn't mention the factory exhaust manifolds now these came off of a 77 Z28 uh, now these would fit on there no problem uh, I would use these over those any day and guys uh, you know the the sad part of it is is uh, those don't really make that much more horsepower than uh, factory exhaust manifolds not that much more And if you get ram horns okay maybe you know they make a little bit more but not not much I think ram horns would probably be better I don't happen to have any but I wanted to throw this out there that um, I may just put these on and remove those if they give me any more hassle so alright alright gearhead 327 out